Hey, what's up YouTube? Brian Fajoli here. And in front of me I have something really crazy looking, right? Uh, no, that's not some kind of a weird futuristic killer robot. This is actually, I'll show you the box here, the Joby Gorilla Pod mobile vlogging kit. So what exactly is the mobile vlogging kit? So it is a tripod that you hook your phone to. It has a special light as well as a microphone. And we'll take a look at some of this stuff right now. So if you're not familiar with these Gorillapod tripods, what makes them cool, is you can see all these different little circles here, they will grab onto something. So let's say you're out alone and you wanna do some vlogging or some video recording. You can wrap this, wrap these legs, adjust the camera here. You can adjust these legs, let's say around a um, tree branch or a fence or something to get it stable to where you don't have to worry about um, it falling over. Now, yes, you can use a regular tripod when you're out and about, but let's say, you know, something is happening that's not on a flat surface, right? You're not always gonna be able to get a flat surface or the best surface for your camera. These Gorilla Pods are amazing for that because it allows you, as you can see here, it allows you to basically mold it in all these different ways. It's almost like a weird Gumby, Gumby doll or something. So we also have here, Let's start here, the microphone. So when you have a smartphone, smartphones have pretty decent microphones these days, but this, you have this like wind boom on here too, which pulls off. You have up here a microphone that connects to this arm. You could also connect it to the top if you want. There's, there's many different ways you can hook this up. But basically, this is gonna plug into the 3.5 millimeter jack on your smartphone. If your smartphone doesn't have a 3.5 millimeter jack, you would use your um, USB type C to 3.5 millimeter jack. If you have an iPhone, it comes with this right out of the box, which is cool. And you have a lightning to 3.5 millimeter audio. So let's say you have an iPhone, you just leave this plugged in, and when you put your iPhone up into the top of the tripod, you would plug this into the bottom, and rather than use the iPhone's microphone, you're gonna use this high-end microphone. How cool is that? And if you're out like in the wind or whatever, this should help um, like as a wind boom. It just snaps, just basically goes right on the top. You don't have to use it, it's optional, um, but it does come with that in the box. And that's gonna connect to your iPhone. Now, what's really cool is that I'm gonna take off this, this just unscrews, Ooh. and I wanna show you how nice, how nice this camera is, as, I, as the light is, rather, as I drop it. So, here is the LED light. So, this will prevent, like, glare on your lens. It kind of diffuses the, the light better. This is also optional, but I would just probably leave that on for most uses. Now, what's cool here, Get how I open this up is, ah, oh, here we go, all right, right over here. So here on the bottom, we have two buttons. W hold one of them down, I believe it's the bottom right. If I hold it down, whoa, we're gonna get some crazy light. And the idea is this is gonna be mounted on the arm and it's gonna face the direction of the thing that you're shooting. Now also then we have the left button which as we press, or is it the right button? Let's see, I get confused. So the right button, if we press it again, we can turn down the lumens, make it less bright. And then we turn the left button, we'll turn it back up brighter. So you can go like super, super bright, or you can turn it down and um, make it even dimmer. Now to turn it off, I believe we hold down the right button again. Yes, that turns it off. Uh, it has um, underneath this, and this was like, Oh yeah, here it is. So on the top, this just pulls up, if you see here, and there's a little rubber piece here. Now this is really cool. Underneath this rubber piece, obviously, is how you would charge it, but what makes it especially cool is it's USB Type-C. How freaking cool is that? So you basically have a USB Type-C light that 
you can connect up to the arm. You can connect you know, many different ways. You don't even have to, you can just put it like this. You can place it somewhere. You can put this on a tripod by itself. It has tripod threading right there. So you could put this on its own tripod if you want. And the light is just super bright. I mean, if you're shooting something that you, you know, want to, uh, I don't know, really illuminate. Uh, oh, I'm shooting this knife here. You can get better, let's say if I turn off the light. Yeah, you can focus better on the thing that you're shooting. You also have this to diffuse the light, so you don't get like the same glare. Let's see if I put this here. So here's a phone, and if I put it like this, all right, you got this glare, right? And I don't think it's gonna remove the glare entirely, but it should diffuse it a bit, let's see. Yeah, not so much on a reflective screen like this, but, oh, that is bright, holy cow. Okay, so let's turn off this light and I'm going to reconnect it up here. You guys can see me do that. So this connects up here. Okay. All right, so now Let's say I was shooting something in front of me. Again, let's say the subject is my trusty uh, trusty knife here and put that down over there. On the top, and this is a little hard to shoot just because it's so big, but on the top here, we also see this slider. Now this slider, what's really cool, is you would place your phone in it. There is me. You'd place your phone in it. You'd put that down. Then on the back, you would just twist this up. And now it's tightened up. Now this phone is snug in here. And now, let's see here. So this particular phone has a three and a half millimeter port on the side here, I believe, yep. So we'll snap that in. So now, imagine this. Imagine this. I want to photograph or video that knife there, or whatever, whatever's in front of us, right? Uh, do I have anything nicer to put there? No. So let's just say let's just say it's a knife, uh, or uh, let's say it's an NES controller. There we go, an NES controller here. So let's say we wanted to record that NES controller. Now we would then go ahead and we go. Okay, let's turn on the light, turn that on, and we could focus that light right on the subject. You can see there. Um, the microphone is now positioned at that. We could also, now let, that's not something that's going to talk, right? So you could also position the microphone and turn it around facing you if you're going to be talking or doing like an unboxing video. Um, and then here you'd have your viewfinder. And on the front of the device, as we can see there, you'd have the camera facing the subject that you're recording. Wow, that light is bright. Holy cow. So this is like, a one, like an all-in-one tool where you're getting a tripod. Uh, a high-end light, a high-end microphone, uh, and a holder for your phone to, to use it with a tripod. And again, this is the Gorillapod tripod, meaning you can wrap this around things. You're getting a lot of options here with the Gorillapod mobile vlogging kit. And you can even, like it shows here in the picture, put the legs together and use it as a holder. They're just the, the sky is the limit type of a thing. So it also shows here you could hook up, uh, let's say, another camera on the side, like an action camera. Um, lots of different things here. Show the back of the box, everything that it comes with. So you do get the tripod itself, and it shows you all the things you get. So you get the microphone, you get uh, two, three and a half millimeter audio uh, cables. Uh, you do get the lightning port adapter, the camera itself. Uh, comes with a USB-C charging cable. Um, fog like a pro. Get better sound. Get smoother content. Those are all the ways you can use it. Um, yeah, so that's that's pretty much it, folks. That is the amazing vlogging kit. My only critique so far is it can be a little bit confusing of how to hook everything up um, or how to use the camera. Um, I didn't even realize, uh, let me turn off the camera here. I didn't even realize how to charge it at first. I was like, how the heck do you even open this up? You just pop that open there. 
Um, once you get the hang of everything, it's really, really cool. I like the way that this locks in the phone. I've had other things that are just spring-based, uh, where like you lift it up and it's immediately clamping down. This is kind of a, a nicer uh, option where you just kind of tighten the back screw and now it's it's locked in and placed on your phone. It's not as easy to just quickly pull out. You have to go around in the back and untighten it for a second, but I think this will hold a lot better, uh, especially when you're mobile and you're holding it um, and you're walking around. You don't want your phone to fall out. Um, so Joby's done a great job there of securing the phone. Just really, really nice. I mean, you got, you got a lot of options here. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below and I will put a link in the description of where you can buy this really cool vlogging, uh, mobile vlogging kit. All right, folks, thank you so much for watching and have a great day.